and we're teaching you how to do a mime. We're teaching you how to be a mime. But one of the things that people always want to know is what's the difference between a clown and a mime? Now, a mime will have the makeup, will look like an actual mask. And he will actually, I actually kind of look like this. I have a nose and eyebrows and mustache and all of this stuff. It's just a mask. A clown will take an entire character onto himself. The makeup will go all the way down the neck and he will have an attitude painted on his face. He'll have a big smile, he'll have a big frown, he's the sad tramp, he's the goofy this, but a mime has to be neutral so that he can become all of these different kinds of people, where a clown is just one character. The mime can be all sorts of characters. Also, the mime costume is much different. It's very simple. It's not gaudy. You want to be able to see the motions that you're doing. It's not big floppy sleeves. It's not a big floppy clown suit, all right, because you're not one character. You want to be all these different types of characters. And that's how, why it's very, very simple on a mime. And that's why a lot of people don't understand, because they'll see a complete character on a clown, yet they won't see the character on a mime. And you have to then become the different characters. And that's the whole difference. I don't have a red nose, all right? I don't have uh, a lots of sparkles, but you can tell right off I'm a certain type of mime. But the clowns will have a whole different character onto itself, and each clown has to look different in their faces. They go out of their way to make sure each face looks different. Meanwhile, the mime face pretty much all looks the same.